Hello. Welcome to my channel. The time now is 12-22, August the 30th. And my story today, before I do anything else, I want to give praise to the Most High and in all my native brothers in the Midwest. Many Machone, water is life. Because without water, you won't survive, no matter what kind of other stuff. Because water quenches your thirst. My story today, I'm just going to give you all a little taste. And the day is uh, Wednesday. Yeah, I'm going to give you a little taste of Indian history. Jamestown was founded in 1607. Then they had a uh, winter of the winter of 1609. It was cold, stuff like that. Then 1610, the governor of England came and governed a town in Jamestown. That is a little little stuff. I want to go into it, but this video goes out to Molly Love. You know. I told y'all before she needed a lot of help and tender and love and care. Somebody that really cared, like her mother and father, they really care, but you know, they they, they need help and we also need help and we're all trying to raise money to to get our dream home. So if they ain't donate somebody wanna give, they can give it. Um my cash app. Here it is once again. You go to that. And um, what I want to get into, uh, my topic today is about Indians and what they uh, achieved and accomplished in the United States since everybody else is trying to write the Indian law, but that's impossible to do. You would never be erased from history, no matter what people say, what people try to claim that they this and that, and when they're not, and people should always go by paperwork, like I said, and with the government say, everybody believe what the government say. If a person not documented, that make him not legal. Well, the people that document, people are not legal either. So how could y'all go by that uh, logic? Some people believe, like some people believe, you don't have a birth certificate. You can't prove that you're a United States citizen. But damn it, his answer was already here. So he can prove it. You had y'all follow that uh, um, fake bull, bullshit about you ain't got documentation, you are legal. Well, your birth certificate is illegal anyway, because if you get your birth certificate, it's a stock bond. You can look up online, like I said before, and see what you worth on the online, but you can't get nothing for it. You just get like a a military sentence without your permission because if something bad happened. They have forced you to go fight in another country. That's why they give you all that stuff. You ain't had no license or birth certificate for that stuff. So when the immigration is illegal, it's a legal government office. But how are you going to set up shop on somebody's land and say you can't come to the country because you're not a citizen? Well, their answers weren't citizen either. They're like I try to tell people about these audit people. They do not care about no audit. Per they care about getting the, uh, and they know a lot of time when they see signs, they go and stand until somebody come out there and you don't see no news reporter do what they do stand in front of city hall, filming all day. They don't know how to film right. And um, when a lot of them say, I never broke in the law, I guess a lot of y'all never was locked up for um, kidnapping and rape. That's the ones that be talking all that bullshit and stuff like that. But what I was saying, Indians have accomplished a lot too. Indians made leather pants, you know, stuff like that. And uh, he was found for shoe. He invented things too. Everybody else wanted to take the credit. Like nobody else can invent things unless you had to be a person of color. And like I said before about this about those statues that everybody see. When you see a statue, that's probably how the people saw it and they carved them. That don't necessarily have to be a black person. But see, in, in people's minds, they wanted to be a black person. So they can say that they respond for everything in the United States. Yeah, they respond for a lot of things, but so of indigenous people, you don't have nobody like rubbing that in about what they did here. You know, that's why I get so upset with certain people. 
in the I thought I put oh and see Vinnie Machoni. Waters of life. And the proper way to say OCO, like everybody run that OCO, is really O C Yeho. Remember that. And um Cherokee, it's not the name. The original name is Chalachi. That's how you pronounce it. Okay. Pone. I'm just short cutting it short. I'm so tired. But I just want to throw that little history out there to y'all. Give y'all something to think about. I don't make my videos too long. When you make them too long, people get bored. Because it's like an hour 55 to two hours. You ain't going to listen to nobody talk that long. So I make mine sweet and short and get right to the point. So, so when y'all look it up, it'll be like 25 to a half an hour. Not no two hours long because that's the person that's one of his. They used to hand their self talking, seeing their face, so they the one got the big eagles and chip on their head. But for now, uh, I'm getting ready to go to sleep, Water's Life, and um, Benny Machoni, and y'all get praises. Most high, don't forget him. But without him, nobody would be getting anything in this country. I talk to y'all later. Dada da wado. Let me have a blessed night. Yawish. Thank you. So I talk to y'all later. I'm gonna have something more, something to say tomorrow. You know about slavery and Indians.